So in that recent front of the initiative order, you actually see this imp turns invisible as well, almost ending the process he was in earlier where he was transforming into some kind of strange creature. And give me perception check, um, snuggle bum. All right, I'm still not able to get in the roll twenty. Okay, I get you. I get you. He got you, bro. What do we got Thanks, there? Bro. Twenty-one. Way to go, snuggle bum. Um. You hear this this fluttering and uh, notice up in the corner of the room there that there's this hole almost between the floorboards to the next floor. And you see some dust fall down. Um, you get the impression that these imps, after turning invisible, have fluttered up through this hole to possibly head up to the next level. Um, the room falls silent after that with the exception of the beholder you can hear in the stairwell. Um, confused at this this obstacle it can't get past it can't move any further forward um, at this point we can actually end initiative order as the corgis are all hauled into the safety room here nice. by Fanny so feel free to move yourselves as you wish um, right now the beholder is distracted with this door you can see through the window and the door, his eye stalks kind of just scanning it and him floating around this this boulder. He will attempt to shoot the door just to see if we get the no-no, Ray. It does not. You see one of the beams of light go and kind of cut across the door, but the door just seems to have a cut in it now. How do we get out of here? I don't know why I just became Jester. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a way to go up? Or? Can you please put... Okay, there we go. How do we get out of here, guys? I don't, up I don't further? understand. Any other so, way out? How do the we rest of the bar group is definitely downstairs having oh. like a quick impromptu tea party because the, the, there's a rock in the way of going down and there's a big scary guy who definitely needs like four more hugs. Um, I'm gonna go towards the door and I'm gonna try and shout out to the bard. Hey guys, um, there's a big old boulder and you can't come upstairs, so maybe you should just go home and wait for it there. Uh, that's, that's what I was saying the whole time, but what about y'all? There's a big scary thing up here and we're gonna try and go upstairs to go around it because it's shooting nope, no blazers. But wait a second, we haven't tried one thing, y'all. The most important. Thing. What I mean, if this I, guy just needs a friend? I don't know. He looks really I mean, scary. Why don't we I wait and see who's at the scary top of this thing? Need friends too. I know, but I'm thinking maybe there might be other people who need friends more than this scary guy who I don't want to be friends with. Can we make people friends two more times or only one more time? We can make people friends two more times, but this guy is really scary and I don't but that's, see, that's not nice. What if he's really nice? He just I, looks scary. He cut off Corgi number six's arm! <laughs> can I can I do an intuition and see if I can tell if that thing is still... No, I wouldn't know what the difference between an alive and undead thing is. Um, um, yeah. I mean, y'all are clear it's undead, but but friendship doesn't know the boundaries of, of the mortal coil. Yeah, All it does. <laughs> if he had a friend, he wouldn't act like that. I'm just saying. Friendship <laughs> Um, uh, Gigglefoot. Oh, Gigglefoot? At least, at least, Gigglefoot, at least you'll still have your feet to make you giggle. <laughs> giggle finger and giggle neck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that makes sense. Um, are you all giggle right? Gigglefoot, I'm, I'm going to give you a cupcake and it's going to make you feel a lot better, all right? Now, sure. here's a special made I'm cupcake. losing a lot of jelly. It's I fine. I'm going to take the cupcake jelly. and I'm going to mash it on his inner. <laughs> Keep that jelly right inside there. Oh. That's what you do. I don't know if that's happening. I don't know that's... I'm going to lay on hands him with the next cupcake. 
him, and I'm gonna give him. What did you? HP. What did you do with the first? This is Jim. I, I just wanted to just knew, okay, got him. knew it I, wasn't gonna work. Just, like complaining, I'm just gonna. Shh. <laughs> as you as you lay on hands, um, he does indeed I... look to get a little healthier, um, and the wound itself kind of closes over. <sighs> kind of force a cupcake slowly into his mouth as he's complaining. <laughs> Granny's always right. Granny knows best. Now just eat that cupcake. So this... I, I don't think that you're in your health, but that doesn't Granny matter. <laughs> Granny opened the doors that rolled a boulder on me. Granny, <laughs> Granny makes the door with Granny, please. <laughs> Granny's psychotic. I think the tower's starting to wear into Granny. <laughs> Granny, that like way. we're lying. I just wanted to have snowball fights, and now we're all gonna die. <laughs> that does sound rough, young one. That does sound rough. You know what? I think you've earned a blondie. <laughs> Here you go, darling. I don't want it. Here you go. I smoosh it into your mouth as well. <laughs> like <laughs> <sports>. horrible. <laughs> this is getting pretty out of hand here. <laughs> you just say that because you haven't had your key lime square yet. Here it is, young man. It's key lime. <laughs> Okay, um, let's let's figure out how to go upstairs. That's not using the stairs. Well, we just first you have to believe in yourself, and then you just ascend. Maybe we can get him away from there. I don't know. Just throw those bells, and we can follow him. Oh yes. Uh, maybe maybe it's not Mr. Snugglebomb. Since you're still in that other room, maybe you grab that bell and throw it over in that corner, and then we can try and go up the stairs. I want to get more than one bell, though. I'm gonna I'm gonna collect like There's as only many as I can. There's it's well. Uh, they took two bells with them. There's already one over here. Yeah. There's one right here, and then there's. I'm gonna get a couple, gather them. Okay. Uh, and 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 I want to actually throw them all in a big bunch into that corner, away, like in the northeast, away from there, and try to draw his attention away. Right. Give me one sleight of hand check to that I act as a general sleight of hand to grab all of these bells, without setting them off. All right, I still need you to roll. You for still me. need me to roll for you. You're. Roll 20. We love using you. Please work for us. Yeah, it usually, I mean, it usually works great. I mean, that, yeah, this is an unusual. Yes. 16. Um, I'm going to say that's good enough to grab all three bells without having them ring too loudly. Um, okay. I, I guess you need to make a range yeah. attack to throw them over in the corner. All right. So just give me a dex roll. Oh, man, you're just as bad as me. A five as, as nice. the bells ring. Oh, cool. I can... Cool, I got your character sheet now as an extended window. Um, as the bells don't go quite where you want them to go, but I will say it's enough to move the beholder out of the stairwell and back into the room of darkness. Hey, All right, and then I'm going to creep down to join them. Okay, I'm going to give you a stealth. 20 on stealth, snuggle bum. All right, y'all no, enter. Us and the corgis are gonna try and go on up. Head up. Cause they can't go down. To the next. Yeah. My last action, I want to leave a pie for him. And I want no no I'm yeah I'm gonna leave a pie, like right here. And it's going to be a cho uh, chocolate pecan pie. And I'm gonna, what am I gonna put on top of it so that it. I want to create a small trap so that it'll slowly, something's going to slowly fall and clatter. Mm. I have some baking sheets. I have a spare baking sheet <laughs> that I precariously put on the wall to give me time to go up the wall, but eventually it's going to make noise and there's going to be a pecan pie right there beside it. That's All what right. I do. All right. Create a small trap to feed the angry beholder. So that he knows where a pie is, but you're giving yourself time to get away. Yes. All right. Granny's going to feed the world, whether they like it or not. All right, so you reach the next level, and there is a single wooden door to the north of you that leads into what you can tell, maybe another room. Again, small barred window in the door. Um, 
the room itself looks directly across from it is an open room. You see daylight cascading in from above, as if the room in front of you does not have a roof. Hey guys, I guess we gotta knock. Knock, knock, knock. Is anybody in there? It's us, we wanna come in. I hope you're not pooping. Knock, 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 knock. As the Corgis all kind of join in with the song. I brought cupcakes. They're lavender scented. We're coming in right now. I can up. hear you. Hey. Hope you're not pooping. If you are, we'll do the oopsie dance. Someone open the door. Let him in. Oh, hey. We're going to be best friends. Be friends. I know it, sir. Uh, the door slowly opens, and you see a small, hairless creature with a long, pointy nose and knife-like ears. Come out. Come out in. Uh, I found a door earlier that had a very big, a very big cutty blade, and I have strawberry jam that just went everywhere. So I just gotta look for that before I go in anywhere, cause I don't like that. No traps. Go look around and make sure there's. What's a trap? <laughs> <laughs> he walks off. Uh, go ahead, and make a perception I check. I hand him before he walks off. I hand him a double dark chocolate um, cupcake. All right. Fourteen. All right. Roll a roll a performance, Granny. Do I get an advantage because it's for our baked good? <laughs> uh, no. I'm gonna say it's an advantage. The reason this is in exchange for a uh persuasion. Yeah, <laughs> he just kind of licks it and walks off. He doesn't actually eat it, and he rejoins yeah, over here. Part. You do not see any traps as you enter the door, Fanny. The corgis join y'all through the door, filing through. You can just put me on there, Chris. And do 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 do. I'll stay with my buddies. I would like to be in front of the corgi. Is it gonna let me? There we go. Where would you like to place yourself? You want to be more towards the front with them? Snuggle I'll be in the bump. Back. Okay. Behind everybody. Behind the corgis. All right. So y'all file in, and what you see is the room you entered actually has an opening above it. The floor above you has no walls necessarily, just long podiums that are holding up of a roof. You see that the staircase goes up beyond this roof, but on the story above you is a wooded platform that kind of crowns the room you're in. Tied between this platform, there is a large cage filled with forest fam. Oh no, why are you in a cage? Oh man. Is that that's a little party? Is this a game? It's a new game, this, isn't it? I've not of, heard of it. You I don't like this. This on, is not a good games. party game. On top of the that's room that was just game. across from the door has a ceiling at the second story level. And on that, on that platform is this tall hunched old woman with this long ratty nose and you see the two imps kind of hovering next to her and she's got a clipboard in front of her what are you doing welcome this doesn't look like a fun party game they aren't <laughs> i mean don't judge you don't know what game's fun until you've tried it oh it this, no, I'm, I'm this one's judge. really fun i'm gonna judge this no, a, a snowball fight is a fun game. Sitting in a sitting in a metal metal bar room is not fun. Oh no, no. not for you, not for the one sitting in the room, but the one who built it gets to enjoy watching. No, but party games are supposed to be fun for everybody. You see, that's, that's right. what parties are for. Pale aces you have fun with it. everybody, because if everybody's not having fun, it's not a good party. <laughs> right. Sharing is caring. Fun the most important is part of any party. Party is fun. fun Hurting is people is party, not fun. Party is fun. Oh, Bill. We haven't tested usefulness against goblins yet. Slick. Gut. Cutter. Get him. And you see the, the two goblins <laughs> start stepping forward. What are we getting? <laughs> And they take large, they take large no, butter knives out. out. Let's hug this out. Come on, they, come on. Come on. 
This looks like Definitely. it needs friendship hugs. We want to do our thing. I feel like. <laughs> y'all are going. Y'all are going to actually attempt it now. I think we need to go bring us. Bring. Are you gonna do it? I want to hug them first a little bit. Try to bring them in. Us three will come together. We'll, we'll invite them in. Come on. Uh, Bring it in. <laughs> Pers it. We're gonna persuasions. If, hug, if you're hug. if you're gonna do this, go ahead and roll the roll the D4, D4 to see how many rounds it's gonna take to get this off this round. Um, I will oh, I I will say the hag above you is within sixty feet, as are the two. Dang, I've only got to keep this up for one round. One a one? Yes. A single round. So let me cancel out initiative. We'll reroll initiative, and we just got possibly one round of combat if uh, all three of you can survive a goblin attack. All right, don't just let's just hug it in, hug it out, bring them in. We're gonna hug it out. We're gonna hug it out right now, right now, grannies. These arms were made for hugging, and I haven't gotten to it. You have to do my initiative for me, Chris. Grr. Okay, will do. I rolled initiative, and then you took me out of initiative, so I guess I do oh. it again. Yeah, go yeah, ahead and reroll. If you remember what you got before, you can. I'll, I'll hand put it in if it's higher. It was 50, and that's my third crit fail. Do I get a, fi a feat? <laughs> Re reverse alertness. Uh, it, can it so be minus extra defensive? Five, minus five to initiative, and you're always surprised. This is gonna be a. This is gonna be an interesting one. Uh, snuggle bum. Whirling through the air, I'm flying in the air, flying in the air, flying in the air. That's where I really got it. <laughs> All right. So it looks like the goblin gets to go first. Um, he sees y'all and the corgis all kind of get inside this big friendship hug. Um, and immediately his first options for attack here are between Granny and Franny. Come on, we're just gonna hug it out. Come on. Come on. We're gonna do evens odds. Evens is Granny, odds is Franny. Fanny, sorry. Hey, y'all be nice now. Runs up, Fanny. takes his overly tr overly large butter knife out. That's a big knife. I don't know why you need a butter knife that big. Do you have really large bread? And he attempts that meets my AC. <laughs> that meets your AC. Eight slashing damage as he brings his butter knife across. Um, but you know, I think I'm gonna cough up a little bit of a hairball. Oh, <coughs> oh yes, you're. And um. Uh, <laughs> gonna use your super uh, fluff. Uh, and a, a hair mat. Hair mat, invisible barrier. <laughs> it's a little hairball. All right, and you're <laughs> casting time one reaction, which you make when you're hit. Excellent. Plus so five bonus, until, so misses. Until the start of my next turn, I have a plus five. Eight. All right, so you you cough up this hairball and his he uses his knife to deflect it instead, completely saving you from the attack. <laughs> um, is there any non-offensive action you would like to take, Mister Snugglebomb? I want to use my turn to tell a little story about a very lonely goblin that I learned about as a child. And he lived in a cave, and he was really angry because he didn't have any friends. Uh, and I want to go on, and, and, and as we're sitting here hugging it out, and be like, the, the moral of the story is this guy didn't have any friends, and he was a bad guy, and once he got some other friends, then, it, then he, he learned the power of friendship and how that can actually make you happy and fulfill you in life. And then trying to bring these guys into the hug, just bring it in, you'll understand. Bring it in. <laughs> Give me a uh, <laughs> give me a persuasion at advantage since you included the goblin in your story. Wait, so yeah, uh, if you'll roll that for me. Oh, fuck it. I'll, I'll remember eventually. On the bad, very man. last I mean, time you have to roll in the entire game, you'll remember. Yeah, that'll be it. Yeah. Uh, right. Persuasion. Oh, Seventeen per oh, persuasion. Doing? Coming from Mr. So Snugglebomb. Going last. Fanny, do you have any non-offensive actions you would like to take? Um, All right. Again. Just gonna keep dancing in the breeze, dancing in the breeze. Hey, hey, hey. That one over there is telling stories. 
so you're now going to enter Swirling around in a teacup. It's gonna, it's gonna be one, two, two for two. Fanny, this three, four for Granny, and five, six for uh Snuggle Bum. Granny. Is it Granny or oh, Fanny? Me? Oh, that's right. No, Fanny. Fanny was two, three, or Granny? No, Granny was, Granny was, was three, four. I, was, I, I was, thought I was three, four. I thought Granny was, Granny was one, two, and Fanny. Okay. Was two. Or was it the other way around? We'll move it to you. Yeah, you were make it me. Make it me. Lit, literally asking for it, I suppose. I am literally asking. For it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting concerned. I can't do anything yet. But you still, you still have that plus five to the hairballs no, due to the hairballs. I don't. But oh. it still doesn't mean Macy, because okay. I still have super flux. Super, oh. it's got super flux last day hours. Jeez, that is a long duration. Dude, I didn't write mage armor. I didn't, I didn't write <laughs> that eight hours. That is I truly wrecked. I have underrated I, mage armor. <laughs> I just, I just, I just named it. I thought it was like maybe an hour. I didn't think it lasted this long, but I ain't mad about it. Like. An hour should have. Yeah. Also, like, I thought it would be like not a max. Concentration. An hour is a lot. That is sick. It's not concentration either. Mm -hmm. It's not concentration. It's just. I know what. Hours. I know what my next caster is grabbing. What's it bump you up to? Right. Uh, it takes me up to a sixteen. Because it's thirteen. I'm good for a magic. For a magic. I'm a believer. I'm a converted to mage I just, armor. I, I never took it. Can't I was wear just like, any nah. Any kind of armor, but I ain't mad about it. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty sweet. In attack, coming at Granny. No, not Granny. And a miss. It misses. <laughs> Better not hurt Granny. Spoilers, we're about to find <laughs> out goblins are not effective against us. We are back to... Oh, this is the last the last thing in initiative. So, Granny, is your action, is there any non-offensive actions you want to take? Oh, man. Oh, man, I'm so just indecisive. Okay, it's gonna... Am I the... I'm the very last, aren't I? Uh, yeah. Just in case, I'm going to cast Blessed Brownies. <laughs> Blessed Brownies. I'm going to quickly shove a brownie down every um, all three of our throats. <laughs> all right. Hashtag blessed. Oh. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag right. blessed. I can taste and, the friendship. And as you all eat these brownies with the swirling light and ribbon around you all, the ribbons again leave this bright nova of light you've created from your powerful friendship hug and they wrap around the goblins and the imps and the uh, hag standing on the s stairs above you or the stage above you and suddenly they all begin to change again the imps getting bird-like wings and these nice little robes and they fall to the ground the hag's dress or the hag's torn dress becomes a nice dress and her hair stops being less slick and oily and the water in her nose goes away and the goblins themselves stand upright, keep their green skin, but their hair gets all nice and combed. Oh, man. Oh, that's better. What have we been doing this whole time? Oh, hi, guys. Welcome to Snowball Land. I mean, you don't want to be everyone friends. tries some different things in their life. It's just a stage, and you, you move past it sometimes. And sometimes you embrace it, but, you know, you never know. You never know. You got to try different things. We're going to try friendship. See, I told you you'd feel better. Mm. Isn't this better than being mean? Well, let's get everybody out of the let's, let's bring it in for a big group hug. Big group let's hug. Bring bring everybody everybody down. I feel like we shouldn't be in. doing this. Something doesn't feel right. Come on down. No, 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 no. This is perfectly down. natural. Because we're not in this hug yet. Come on, come on down. Come on down. Bring it in for a hug. The, the, imp, the imps story, come down, but the, the granny is still somewhat distrusting. I, I want to hug. I, I look her. deep into her eyes, be like, would these eyes lie to you? And they're like big, solid, black, cute animal eyes. <laughs> I would like to scratch my her. belly. Make a Show persuasion. Big belly. And I would like to purr on, as I, I rub against oh, the, the, the hags. I, I'm, I'm hugging her around her. Uh, oh, she's still, she's still up her. on the stage. Up top. Oh, I, wanna go, so. I want to go up to her so I can hug her and purr on her. Because purring makes everybody happy. I, I rolled a 25 on persuasion. Show my pink belly. 25 on persuasion. Oh, because of the bless. Because of the bless. That's I you know, got it for a minute. So. You can you can That's place yourself in the Hashtag stairwell. Hashtag blessed. If you would like. 
I would like. Because I want to give her a hug around her knees. I gotta look deep into her eyes be like, darling, <laughs> you look like a mud cake kind of person. No. I yes. have one that I made special. I, I'm coming in. My list, my list of duties says goblin fight. It's the only thing we haven't marked oh. off yet. Blood oh. makes good healing potions. Stop. Oh. Get off. You know you want to rub oh, this fat no. belly, but look at it. <laughs> Ready to be slapped. And I just a slowly shove a piece of mud cake in her mouth. You got to get it. <sighs> Continuous purring and nuzzling around her knees. You're doing so good. I believe in you. You're doing so good. She's like, you can clearly see she's enjoying the cake, but she's just trying to keep the facade on. No, it's not. It's, this isn't. No, no, it's it's all right. I fork up another piece. There you go. Just, Give into just it. Another, just another Give piece. The yeah. Just one more. It's all right. One step at a time. A new road is just a road you haven't that walked looks, yet. Is and... it in her hand? What's up? Is that list that she was referring to in her hand? Yeah. List of things. Can I like yeah. casually kind of get it away from her? Uh, make a persuasion at advantage because we're starting to win her over now. Um, you All can right, see, see this you can see that this friendship effect on her doesn't seem to be working as clearly as it has in the past. You can almost see it fighting, like her skin starts to turn green again, then it goes away. Her hair starts to oil up, then it straightens back out again. It's just darling struggling. Darling, we heard you were new in the neighborhood, and we wanted oh, to come and to bring you this giant I'll, sucker. I can't remember. You're in now. Hello. As, I just as a gift. This is a gift from yeah. from us to you, to welcome you to the new neighborhood, because we love new friends. No, 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 no. She actually, you do Plus manage. Four, you're still blessed. I, I'm gonna kind of lift my arms up for her to pick me up. She yeah. does, and she kind of like rests you on her on her hip. It just. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. We need to. We need to. Don't make... forget the plus floor. You're blessed. Uh, I kind of like. Oh no, he 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 doesn't. I mean, go ahead and roll it to see what you get, but you don't need it because she hands you the. Uh, just the D four. No. She hands you the the board as she kind of goes to keep holding, uh, almost like a baby holding Fanny up against her against her hip. Uh, and or her I would waist. like to like kind of like move my hand, move my kind of chin near her hand to kind of like give me space. I'm not, I'm not convinced of this at all. I'm gonna take it and destroy it. It's all it. right. Like it's, that list. Yes. You actually gonna destroy it? I'm gonna burn it with my torch. Okay. No. Make. You don't need this. This is bad news. Make persuasions at disadvantage as you burn her. You burned it. You didn't have to burn it yet. We did. She was her reminder of the bad stuff she's supposed to be doing. But she's struggling uh, me. So does that make it a flat roll? <laughs> oh my That's not bad. Plus a four. A yeah. four or a Plus D? four. You four? burnt all my studies. We had so many more tests to do. So eighteen. Mm, Lord four, guys, is gonna be so angry. Still blessed. It's all Undy. right. It's all right to be angry. He shouldn't <sighs> have done that without permission. It was your problem. No, this thing was bad. So, it was making you do bad things, so it's better off with that. I know, but it's still hers, so you should have asked first. No, people don't I mean, get to she's keep still... that thing. Yes, uh -uh. people's things no. are still people's things. Absolutely. Not if they're going to hurt people with them. Nope. But they're you don't with... know that. It was just a list. Oh, she just told us. Bad thing list. It said bad things on it. So Anyways, gonna we're going to move past it as new friends yeah, should. Move past with it. forgiveness and yeah. love and just the best of friendship you'll feel. You'll, I feel like you'll really mesh with the community, you know? Friends it's so don't let get friends do tall. bad things. It really just friends. sounds so disgusting. I'm just going to start making kitty biscuits on her side. Uh, oh, I mean, yeah. Make you could have different ways of showing your friendship. Some Normal. people show friendship in different ways. How do you show friendship? Make one last persuasion checks all around. I usually Friends offer someone that. a gift in exchange for another gift that I usually get back or higher payment. Fours to those. Oops. I was not at disadvantage, but... Jeez. You know, I bet you would make the best store owner. You meet so many new people, you get to sell things, and then you get things, and then you sell different things. Like cursed yeah. items. 
Yes. Things that I can Blessed sell them that will find their way back into my possession. Oh, oh, sometimes, sometimes people attach fun pranks to them. Doesn't that sound like a good time? Yeah. Like, like every time someone wears their shoes, it'll suddenly untie them. Isn't that sound so funny? Yes, I could enjoy that. Just, just little mischief things. You can right. make a fun new mischief secret could person. Work. Practical like jokes. Fun time? Like snakes yes. in a jar of peanuts. Exactly. Poisonous snakes. Oh, no. It's starting to turn oh, green again. Opens the door, one. and suddenly a whole rain of flowers drops on them, and they were flowers. Like flowers that spray acid. Or snowballs. That spray acid. No or acid. Mud. That's also no spray. That's actually acid. You know? No nice acid. Mud. A no, lovely no swamp acid. area. Did you know? Like we had an ogre who was living there, but he moved out recently to be with his um his wife's family. But it still has a lovely shack that I feel like the aesthetic is just so you. So you. Yes. I could make a home here. There's lots of mud. I mean, I feel like you definitely look like a mud bath kind of person. You know, sometimes you can just tell. Plenty of resources. And she looks over at the cage of the forest fam. No, they have to come home with mm. us, though. I mean, it is flower gathering season. Have you tried going to a flower gathering party? They are the best. Sometimes we get a little wine. <laughs> they have alcohol here. Uh, it's, mm. it's only very low grade, and everyone it's, it's is just called, like it's, lightly buzzed. You can't go past wine, lightly buzzed. But there's no wine coolers. It's just, it's just dandelion lemonade, essentially, but we call it wine. Mm. It's good. Dan dandelion cooler. I know because what. afterwards we do a share circle where everyone talks about like maybe some slight disagreements that they've been having, and we just hug it out. We just hug it out. I did find these really interesting mushrooms in the woods. Um, they make you have really cool like dreams when you're awake. We could all eat those. I together. thought purple was a real living person. Like the color purple was a person. Yeah. So if we want to maybe you know have a bite of this, be interesting. Yeah. One more round of perception checks, and she's like, "Yes, I give her persuasion. persuasion." Sorry, yes. I'm giving a, her shrooms, by the way. So a I can tell swamp, it. some shrooms. <laughs> <laughs> She's really excited about them shrooms. <laughs> All right, fine. I mean, experimentation is fine. Mm. But you should probably try it on like vegetables. You're with friends. We'll take because care of you. Because we're not potatoes. You're not, not potatoes. potatoes. That's we're clear. We're not potatoes. We're not potatoes. If it squeals, no, you we're don't not. kill. You yeah, y'all do taste better than potatoes, though. In all no, fairness, I'm sorry. That was rude, wasn't it? I, that's I, not. Yeah, that no, no. Well, I don't think that that rude, was rude. Though, but you are absolutely are, wrong. You can fry them, mash them, put them in a stew. You can. <laughs> because you have not tried like Granny's raw. special mashed potato special. There are lots of stuff besides potatoes you can eat too, by the way. I, I whip out some mashed potatoes that I have in my pocket. I Everyone was talking about them. I just had to make some. These are my special mashed potato recipe. Passed down to my family for four generations, and I made them better. Do you have any of those this sweet is, potato muffins? You the might secret want is the, 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 the bacon really bits. And copious amounts of butter. So much butter. Did you say bacon bits? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wait a second. Wait a s wait, what did you say? <laughs> no 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 no. What's it's not bacon? important. It's not important. Lanny? What I is have, that? I have some concerns and I wanna kinda no, like. No, wait. darling, darling, me and the like, like, This is one of the adult conversation. Are those a kind of berry? It is. Lanny? Never heard of that before. Um, it's entirely herbal. Uh, bacon Lanny? bits. They grow on trees or bushes or Mm -hmm. There's the bacon tree in the backyard. Oh, okay. I've hidden it because I'm the only source of the bacon tree. I haven't heard of that before. I would like to I make mean, an insight your grandfather check has if Granny <laughs> actually evil. <laughs> make, it, make an insight. Do you make an insight? You're going to eat some snuggle bomb? Nine. I'll leave it up. I'll leave it up to Fanny. We're talking about filleting and, <laughs> no, no. and the, the dark backstory bomb? is Granny used to be a hag too. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's fully converted. 
she's just, she's just another brainwash tag that was just she this happened to her like a few dozen years ago it's too. awesome and now she does it. all the baked goods the, the towers turn her back around slowly which is why she got so like yes. so <laughs> evil out of nowhere <laughs> she she it slips out occasionally granny had a backstory granny has his story she, i'm not even gonna insight i just believe her like i don't I, granny I don't I, she straight up has a has a bacon tree though in, in the backyard it's just a tree that uh bacon bits come uh bacon <gasps> strips grow out of it. it's like a willow tree but with bacon i love it granny do me a favor yes for me real quick say if you do that one more time i'll turn you into a newt just say that for me if you do that one more time i'll turn you into a newt sister <laughs> shh, shh it's a secret Wait, Witness. I'm still in the head's arms. <laughs> she, went, she went missing years ago. I thought the paladins got you. It's the paladins. I've been here. Oh, having, having a grand time. <laughs> grand time. These are friend now. We Look got at all the baked goods I've to make. This one has a cucumber essence inside the cupcake. And you're actually the happy here? Which craft goes into making a cucumber cupcake taste good? God, so much work. Yeah, they're pretty bad. Try it. I mean, I mean it's they're not my favorite. for you. It's like zucchini bread, but it's a tiny cupcake, uh, and it's way more favorite. available. Definitely not my favorite. Oh. No, well, if on. you've enjoyed it I, here, I might enjoy it I, myself. I, 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 like, I always thought hagging was just the way to go and just be down with the rest of the cool kids, but no... I, I felt like I would rebel and try something a little alternative. And it's really been working for me. I mean, look how adorable I am. No one would be threatened by me. I'm down. Fine. Friendship it is, then. Friendship. Yeah, I knew it. Friendship. Well, it always wins. wins out. We got a bunch of other friends down there. again. We can't get to them because there's a big rock in the way. I, mean, I could I probably help with, with that. Really big fork. One more time. I'm pretty sure. I was hoping you could right help out. with that. Do you want them to come along with us? Yeah, Everybody we're friends needs now. to come. We're gonna have to go to the village. With your help, you want to help us hug out with that giant ball of eyes? Is you gonna help us here? get that uh, oh, yeah. that rock out of the way? I I gave him a pie, so maybe he'll be oh. feeling more friendly next time. But sightless. A little bit of friendship in it. He'll listen to anything I say. In fact, I bet he can take care of that boulder. He sounds like a good chap. I mean, I knew he was misunderstood somehow. Can you... Can you get him to do that for us? Or he doesn't listen to you, is that what you said? He does listen to me. I'll get him to do it right away. We'll get all your friends together, and then we'll go see the master. I can't just I... leave the house without getting his permission. We'll have to talk oh, to Grunix. Wait, is there somebody else here? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was just you. Oh, no. Well, then we let's really go, need to let's go, go talk see to the master, I guess. Master guy? Is he nice? Maybe you can come with us. Can he is not. He is not nice. Well, we, we'll not have nice. him. We'll make him friends, I mean, too. let's be real here, darling. You weren't nice in the beginning either, and neither was I, and that's all right, and we can grow from it. All right, well, I guess we need to go make friends with this guy, too, huh? All right, so just to get us to the final, the final bit here, <laughs> you go up, you go, you go up, you go up above. I know what that token is. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? It's a freaking uh, lich. It's, it's a lich. A lich. I thought. <laughs> Beholder lich. Go ahead and uh, place yourselves at this. But we don't. We aren't just placing y'all. We we're gonna play. Play. Dang a friend. We we're placing all the friends you brought with you along the way there yes. as well. Which is literally everyone. Uh, yeah, we make so friends with everybody. It's everybody is just like filling. Oh, bring the, the beholder. Room. Don't forget. Uh, and then I'm actually still in the hag's arms. I I never got down, so she's still carrying me. Yeah. And I'm like making kitty biscuits and purring and cuddling and getting scritches. I'm a happy kitty. I'm a happy kitty. Hags love cats, anyways. 
as a general you might become a pet cat after this congrats enjoy your new station in life (laughs) (laughs) to a hag Uh, Ah, where'd I put everybody? She's pretty now. One of my my flaws is that I'm a sucker for a pretty face. So if she's pretty now, it's like, how you gonna cuddle? There you go. There we go. Okay. So we have the orc. We have the team of Keen 2. I honestly didn't write down any personality traits for Granly. She's just been organically the entire way. Llamaoids. I can't say I'm disappointed about it. Oh, these must be on another layer. On the map layer, Chris? Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come yeah. on, Chris. They're tokens. Ah. <laughs> I gotta move all these guys. Too. Honestly, fitting all of these people in here is gonna be rough for you, I feel. The real bit's going to be how y'all handle this. Because this is either going to be an encounter or another long RP to defeat the baddie. I mean, I feel like we could succeed either way at this point, except for the whole we don't really know what combat is. Oh, why would you put the corgis first? That's a bad. <laughs> I like to keep our rumble in a nut fight. Like, we haven't done any real... No, not really. Y'all, all y'all's, all y'all's combat has been peaceful so far. I've been doing my damnedest to not combat, even though I can combat. Yeah. Although I am really... sad I haven't had a restraining hug for anybody. I keep not needing to do it. Well, this I... is massive group hug situation coming up, I feel. I feel like this is definitely the biggest group hug. I biggest will say, out my... for this, Chris, if you plan to use any spells that are 7th seventh le- seventh, seventh level Christ, or lower level. against only me, please let me know. Okay. What? Because I've got a thing. I've got, got a right. thing. Jesus. I've got a thing. I, I, I'm, I'm just going to say I've got, a, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Uh, you talk for a quick moment while I organize something. Oh no. Just in case this just in case this goes so, a certain way, I want to be prepared how, for it. How awesome was it this weekend that we got to uh, showcase some of our material at Com- San Diego Comic Con at home? Wasn't the that stream, cool? That was, list, yeah. it was so cool. Uh, it was really exciting that we got to uh, actually premiere uh, episodes one and two of our new Stargate, uh, the RPG beta test. Uh, homebrew run, uh, which is cool. You can find those online at YouTube, on YouTube, at, on either San Diego Comic Con at home or Wyvern Gaming. That's W Y V E R N Gaming uh, on their channels currently. Uh, they have uh, current rights until uh, re- really the beginning of next week, at which point they will go up on our YouTube channel. Um, it's a super fun time. I got I got the pleasure of DMing that. It's super super fun. Um, was a blast. Yeah, and well, we're going to have to continue, continue cool this as we continue forward, um, and we'll start doing that, maybe not weekly, but bi-weekly uh, at, to start, and then we'll see if we can kind of ramp it up to go weekly. The, uh, the way that the Stargate the RPG will run is uh, it actually runs, uh, uh, each episode is a contained, well, each session is a contained episode. So essentially what you'll see is that each uh, session that we do for Stargate is almost like a, a one-shot in and of itself that will have a, a, a congruous storyline as it progresses through the 13 episode season, um, much like the show, um, as opposed to 22 episodes, though it's 13, because whoops. Um, so that'll be fun, keep an eye out for that, and if uh, you have any ideas or anything like that, feel free to message us, uh, send us send us a drop on YouTube, or you know, if you have any ideas, send something in chat, uh, preferably not bot related, because I gotta say, as like the one person who doesn't really know Stargate as well as everyone else, it was still a real fun time. Mm-hmm. No, that's the cool thing about the system is that um, mm-hmm. it's it's a kind of like a D and D variant, so you really get the opportunity to play with a system that you know if you're not familiar with Stargate, and if you are familiar with Stargate, you still get to you know play with this awesome show that really honestly still stands the test of time, like. 
uh, when I was writing it, I went through and binge watched the first five seasons. And I mean, the first season came out in 1997, and it still holds up quality wise as if it came out five years ago. It's crazy. That's Definitely. truly impressive. I have not writing, binge watched the acting. whole season. Well, good writing, good acting. It had amazing like good plot. Well, it's yeah. not just that. No, I'm talking like the actual production value. Oh yeah, no, it was well like, done. It was so well done. Canada represents. Canada represents. Because those things were made in Canada. Like Star Trek Next Gen, too. Filmed in British Columbia, I think. All right, Uh, guys. Thank you, very, thank you very much for giving me that time here. Because I wanted to, uh, if it comes to a, if it comes down to it, and he needs to start making choices on his targets, I have a a list with a randomizer here, so that I know who we need to keep track of. if it does come down to that, we're not going to go on a turn-by-turn basis with the NPCs here. I'm going to have them use sort of yeah, like a squad no, like, tactics kind of thing. Maybe squ- squads. Yeah, just just so we know if it goes that direction. Swarms, swarms of cute animals. But for now, for now, as y'all all enter the top of this this castle, this this lich's entire personal army has come with y'all. All of them singing on the way up the stairs, the stair song. <laughs> The, the We're going, going up, up the stairs. stairs. Right Let's go foot, one right step, foot, right two foot, step, left foot, right 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 foot, <laughs> Leaning on the edge of his of his of his tower, just rubbing his temple. Everyone, <laughs> everyone, everyone fans out, and he turns around. If you think you're going to convince me to be your friend, it's not going to happen. Why not? That's what the other one said. We love. That's we what love they all kids. said, and we've made friends with all of them. Look at him. And I kind of nuzzle I mean, the hag's arms a little bit. Mm. Look at this sucker that we have Aren't for you. They, it's great. It's already your friends. We're not here to You're make kinda already your friends. friends. Are we, Tuskrind? And he looks at the uh, looks at the orc. And as he does, he do get. Not gonna, f- <laughs> not gonna fall for it, boss. They've already treated me better than you have in years. <sighs> what about you, sister? Perhaps you understand we have serious work here. And I'm still purring in kitty biscuits and snuggles. I'm gonna try and give disadvantage to him. <laughs> he, uh, he, you, she, he would have disadvantage on this check because of that, but he did so low. That... No. My sister's here, and I think I'll be happy here, too. I mean, look at them. They all get along so well. Through teamwork, he made up here without a single fatality. How impressive is that? I and the rest of you. Off, he's doing fine. Can I step up, Chris, since I see the pattern? He's trying to convince all of them and go to the beholder. Yes, he talks to the beholder. you can indeed. And can I cast protection from evil and protect him from his own type, undead, so now he can't be charmed? Frightened or possessed by the death. <laughs> oh crap. Oh. You got me. Smart. <laughs> you got me, sir. And you actually see that he prepares a spell for this one as he attempts to face the beholder. And sure enough, it will not take effect. Damn. The power of friendship, man. Stick even me, even you, blind. <laughs> Fine. We love friends. And he waves his hand, and the trap door behind you shuts. The door you came through. Give me a reason why I shouldn't eviscerate all of you. We're because now. I brought you this really big sucker. <laughs> we're not. Are you sure you don't want to be friends? Even is that? Give him the sucker, right? It's, it's a sucker. This... Sweet. Have you had it's from Papa. before? It's from Papa. I mean, I feel like you're a hard rock candy person. It's not normally my specialty, but I do have these handmade candy canes that I feel definitely are going to speak to you on an emotional level. He holds it. He holds his hand up, and you can feel something pulling at the sucker. An invisible, I hand it to him. An invisible force. 
this was for you. We made it specifically for you. We saw your castle. And you see on the side of it, there's like a smiley face that's also terrifying looking. It looks like his castle. <laughs> not like a, but it's smiling. <sighs> he cracks the cracks the lollipop on the ground and when he brings it up you can now see that it is shaped like a bad lax from where he broke it why would you do that whoa cause you ruined my plans and now I'm going to no, ruin you no we made them better All right. no you didn't we made them so you better. hang back I Let's feel like we bring it in bring Did it in you say your name started with a T my friend will you put me down so we can start a snowball fight just be careful. Okay. I might come back for cuddles in a minute, okay? okay? I'm gonna look at him and be like, you need a minute so we can have a talk, don't you? This guy and didn't I get cast the Channel Divinity, the Nature's Wrath. Living things, yeah. Doesn't get it yet. Snare <laughs> here. Engulf spectral vines and spring up a reachable creature within 10 feet. Spectral vine. Strength or dexterity saving throw, it's choice to be restrained. What do I got? What do I got? What, do what? what? Yeah. What kind of craziness do I have? Spoop. The channel divinity at can you counterspell those suckers? Nope. You cannot. Oh I don't think he has anything. <laughs> <laughs> I've been holding on to this sucker all game. Fair enough. Yeah. This isn't yeah. going to stop me. We're going to sit down and we're going to have a lovely chat about why we're friends now. And you're just going to have to let that happen, right? Persuasion. Um, Persuasion. He needs to learn. Persuasion at disadvantage. He needs to learn. <laughs> Literally meant non-threateningly, but received threateningly. <laughs> 15 is still not bad. All right. I will give you... And we'll give you 36 seconds, half a minute, to explain to me why I shouldn't kill you all. Guys, do we throw in the power of friendship? Power of friendship. You know, I feel like we need to. Mm -mm. If I see any magic, that 30 seconds is off the table. Oh, this isn't magic. This, this isn't is magic. Love. It's just the power of friendship. Friendship, it's love, it's energy. It's not, not a spell. We're not going to hurt I'm going to reach in and be like, you're a tough one. You're a tough one. But that's all right, because I have a very special cake. And it's black forest with blood filling. Blah, blah. She means strawberry. It's it's strawberry. It, it, it was a lot. It put together what she meant. Keep your cake. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to pull out the big ones. And I'm going to go up. And I'm gonna start nuzzling on on his legs and just like rubbing like cats do and purring. And he told me I can get K back. I can get biscuits. He told me I was biscuits. And you turn against that face. Look at that face. Look at her eyes. They've literally grown somehow. They're so big. And your lap looks so warm and comfortable. I'm in the so teacup. I'm not even going to make potions with the three of you. I'm going to make a rug or a coat. I mean, my height would objectively be a bad thing for a rug. Just we'll learn say. how to make rugs together. That sounds fun. Are, are you thinking about taking up crafting? I feel like you would be an excellent rug maker. Like if your you hands are it. so that dexterous. Make them out of grass and like, like, you know, different plants. No. Still not hugging it out? That was mean. She just wanted a hug. I mean... Oh, shame, young man. Did 15, your parents not teach you any better? Like, it's rude to turn down a hug. Fourteen. 
He's crying. I'm gonna run back over to her and have her pick me up and just cry. Better cry. <laughs> Look what you've done! <laughs> Look how sad onion. that is. Jin! That's the worst cry. She's sad. Nine. <laughs> He's mean to me. I'm gonna walk up to him. Eight. And I'm gonna put my hand on his shoulder and be like, I realize that you're trying to be tough because that was what you were taught to do as a defensive measure. And it's all right to be scared. You don't have to be tough here. Here you can be soft and gentle and however else you want to be. It's all right to be what you really want to be inside and not what this hard shell is telling the world. You can just let your true inner self be. You can still also continue to be a lich and live forever as well. If that's what you want to do. <laughs> roll, roll a d100 for me. Ah. <laughs> oh, that's good or bad? Who knows? I was raised by loving parents who taught me I had the strongest inner strength as long as I tried. Nothing about my upbringing was bad. I am what I am. Because I want to be. Nice try, though. That's a solid choice. I'm going to do a uh, trident attack, and I'm going to go a smite, pump like a smite into it. Yeah, I thought he was raised by a necromancer. The lich? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Liches kind of do him. have to get raised, but he is not being okay <laughs> with this talk, so it's time for the extra fork. Are we doing it? I guess so. We're going going initiative then? I yeah. I just I just want the initiative from the three of you and the lich. Um I'm gonna have it be wherever y'all go, then I'll have the other guys go. And I'm still crying into the hag's arms. <laughs> I'm right up beside him because I put my hand on his shoulder to do the better, like deep intuitive talk to him. It didn't work, mind crit, you. Crit, but crit. so close to a crit. Hey Chris, can we so close? So close. That I picked we up. We all a... rolled good ass bells. initiatives. What's up? Can I have picked up a few of those bells before we left that room? Um, you 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 stated that you left them behind, so. Okay. I need to get rid of the goblins. I didn't clear the initiative. What What'd you roll this time? Grandma rolled a twenty this time. So that's that one. So that one can go away. That goblin can go away. Mr. Snuggle Bond, not that one. Oh. Granny 22, not that one. I know what I can do. <laughs> lich. Oh man, of course the Lich goes last. Alright, so y'all have decided to go offensive. Round one, um, we're going to actually, I'm going to actually give Granny here the surprise round since she's decided to state her attack yes. before we roll initiative. Yep. So go ahead and do what you do, Granny. Do it, Granny. Uh, I don't fail though. I get an 18. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I do believe an 18 might miss. No, god damn it. We are so fucked. Yep. That's why I didn't want to fight this guy, but he was just not taking anything. Well, you know what? It hits. Because it, it appears one of the spells that you would expect one of these guys to have that he doesn't have. Is mage armor. Ah. He does not have mage armor. With his base AC being out of 17, that's a hit. I do not do a lot of damage, though. Eight radiant, and let's see. I don't, I don't think he has any weakness to radiant. I don't, I don't remember them having a weakness to radiant. No, he has no... He is... Ah, oh, damn it. That was, like, my only hope there. He does... What type of damage is the five? Uh, piercing. piercing, probably. Piercing. It's the trident. Okay, so you feel like once you strike him... The... Is your trident a fork? It's it's a trident. It's a just... I've called you're it the actually, fork. You're actually... Okay, okay. Okay, I, I just saw the description of it. All right. So when you strike, you notice the, the fork prongs don't really seem to do much when they hit this this beyond life 
character. Instead, it just feels like you're poking into dry hay. But this radiant energy you've put into this, this force of your spirit does seem to continue through the fort, jolt him a little bit. I, I was like, okay, fork's not useful. I drop it. It's still in his ribs, I want to say. They're just there now. Like, all right, back to the old trusty for the next one. Oh, no, Granny. Um, now it is Fanny's turn? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna look Granny up stays right there because she's going to die proud. And I'm going to say, I'm go is, is, do you think he'd like a snowball fight? No, I don't think he'd like a snowball fight. Well, that's my favorite thing, though. So let's start a snowball fight! Um, and I am going to uh, cast Meliok Snowball Swarm. Uh, but I need to do a DC 13 deck save. <laughs> y'all are the best. I love that y'all changed all ability names. I actually, this so one is good. actually, this one's actually the title of the spell. Oh, really? <laughs> I didn't even have to change well, it. It's just perfect. Well, well then I rescind my, yeah. my compliment. <laughs> uh, yeah. I do have another one, though, so. that I will probably use soon. Uh, but this one is, and I'm going to, it's a, it's a, uh, a five foot cube that I'm going to center, like, half on, like, I'll ping it, like, right here, so that it doesn't get granny. Okay. Um, uh, are you doing that, that this is, round, or is it the end of your round? That's right now. I'm doing it right now. Right, I mean, I thought you said you had something else. You mean you're doing the, the other thing next oh, round? Oh, I have a, yeah, another thing next round. Okay, okay. So the, the the snowballs the snowballs hit him and you see some ice kind of form again. This tower seems to make whatever spells you used to play for fun a little more damaging than they should have been. Um, and ice starts to freeze up on him, but he shakes it off. It does seem like it took some bits of him with it though, so it looks like he was damaged, just not maybe as much as you are hoping. Yeah, we we are. Mm. Granny. And he's gonna take out her trusty rolling pin. <coughs> and she's gonna go in at a swing. That's a hit. All right. Nice. And I put it my. Seriously, that's. You just did a lich with a rolling pin. I just hit a lich with a rolling pin. So and threw a snowball at one. And. <laughs> Um, that, like, yes, they'd be bludgeoning. Thing. Which? Lich, please. Which lich? All right. Lich, please. Yeah, I like that. This lich. Snuggle bump. I gotta say. All right. My smites have been disappointing. All right. And Move then I'm Monday. gonna back off because I'm too close yeah, and I don't want area effect stuff. stuff. That's my turn. All right, I gotta reread what this thing did here. So I succeed on a strength or dexterity saving throw, which, uh, Mr. Snugglebum, it is your chance to act. All right, so I'm gonna get my buddy, my beholder buddy. What's his name? Blind or something? Blind, yeah. Blind, come over here. I want to guide him. Well, I don't need to. No, he stepped away. Good. I'm gonna say to him. All right, listen for the sound of the musical notes. And I want you to blast away. And I'm going to use Prestor Digitation to make a sound where the lich is. And I want my buddy here to shoot one of his beams at him. Oh, all right. Solid. Yeah. Uh, give me a, well, Prestor Digitation. That's straight up just, you see yeah, his eyes first. focus on the lich and you see the lich, his eyes widen. Uh -huh. His, his <laughs> eyeballs almost ready to fall out. Is that your is that your turn, Snugglebum? Man, I feel like that's my turn, dude. I want right. to turn it over to my buddy and let him do his thing now. So the beholder's going to go first, and of course we got to see if he shoots the no-no beam. Yes, yes. No, no beam. No, no beam. No, no beam. No, 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 no beam. No, no beam. Oh my God! Twenty-five percent chance. Oh, is there? I don't think there's a save. I think this lich is fucked. Is there a Grayson? <laughs> If that works that well, I was like, there might not be a save. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know. He gets a he gets a save. It's uh, not a, it's not immediate. It's not immediate death. 
okay. the target's the largest smaller non-magic object of creational force system. Okay, okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. cool. <laughs> that would have been horrible. <laughs> it's still it's pretty. Great. It's Go still pretty bad. Still bad. Okay. Yeah. He uh he succeeded his dexterity saving throw. Um, the damage saving throw or take. Okay, so luckily, you know what though. I think I gotta Google something real quick. He's restrained. I'm say, wait, he's restrained still, and he has a sword. Uh, he has a trident he in has his middle still. On his dis his dexterity okay, restrained. so then this is going to hit him. Yeah. He, I I didn't know if restrained said no or just disadvantage, but you're you're yeah, right. Yeah, it's yeah, it's just disadvantaged. All right, so he is going to take the full brunt of this damage. How much? What, what is he rolling? I'm, I'm so excited to see. Way more than I could have done to him. So this oh, yeah. this eyeball just streams across the roof, sending a cut into the stone, and then right up the lich. Just and you see flesh tear as it just disappears into dust. And he's the job line. immediately no longer fucking around. <laughs> We're fucked now. This is when we get collateral. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, but now that is y'all's friends to turn, of course, the Beholder went first. The Orc is going to move up next. Nope, not letting you hurt my friends, guy. These these folks are treat me well. Not like you. Yeah. See, our friends are helping us. This is why you make friends. This is why oh. friendship is magic. <laughs> he crits. Oh, 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 crit oh. Mother. All right. This is a wonderful illustration of why you be friends instead of kill things <laughs> in D&D. There you go. This, right. this is just like the case study for that. All right. And why you look for creative solutions instead of just fighting stuff. I'm going to fight just I'm gonna kill things crunch crunch smash your yep. your force fam are actually going to pull back they're still not quite convinced that fighting is an option here y'all stay safe all right if we survive this we are going to be the battle-hearted forest fam group the hag the hag gets to go and what should I have her do to fight yourself. Yeah, it's it's hard to decide whether I want to succeed at something or not. <laughs> I'll give that. Yeah. Right. What would the character do? Gotta be honest. And she she's still holding me, by the way. She is still holding. Yeah, key cat. Is it okay if I sit you down for a second? That's okay. That's hey. okay. Thank you. And she kind of hobbles over. To the lich and delivers a nightmare touch. Oh no. Okay. Six psychic damage is cursed Ooh. until the hag dies or the curse is removed. Good at it. The target, if the target's unconscious, takes an extra d6. Psychic damage is cursed. Uh, the cursed target's hit points to maximum decreased by 5 or 1d10. Okay. Okay. So not too effective. But still, if he ever gets any health back. Right. And Blitz got himself into the situation. The keen two are going to move around him to offer advantage. Nice. Go goblins are scared. They're falling back. Fair. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, Can't get like flapping and squawking. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you now see that this lich is is surrounded by many of your forest fam, many of the new friends you've earned. Um, Granny, it is your chance to act. Granny's gonna reach out and put her hand on the shoulder of the orc guy and be like, "Young man." Would you like some food, like a quick cupcake in the middle of this good slaughter? 
I, I don't know what's happening right now. I'm, I'm a little blurry on the details. And she's, I want to give him advantage when he attacks. All right. You're giving advantage to the orc? Yes. All right. So Tuskerand now has advantage. A little heart symbol. That'll work. All right. Snuggle bomb. And then the lich. All right. So I'm going to call out Granny, Granny 2, Scary Granny, New Granny. So I'm going to step to the side. And then I want my buddy again. I'm going to tell him, all right, same spot as last time. Do I need to make another precipitation sound, or can he just shoot at the same spot? Um, no, your your, your precipitation is kind of an at will thing, so no need. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to use it, but it's an at will spell, so I don't think you use a spell slot, does it? No, I would just yeah. I could do another action. If it, I, what I'm asking is, oh. does he still know? No, he where still to shoot? he still knows to shoot the lich. Y'all y'all made that clear at this point. Plus, I, uh, the night had claimed earlier, dusk had claimed earlier that she can kind of direct him so wait all right so yeah so keep attacking him good well done so uh, i'm going to then this this calls for a kindness beam so i'm gonna go ahead and eldritch blast the lich all right one deep in force damage rain the I, I don't know why i didn't do the actual attack so it's um rain spell attack Range spell attack dealing 1d10. B, I got a hit on a range spell attack. B20 plus your plus your dex. The same as just a range. Oh shit again, dude. Woo! Nice. Um, it probably doesn't apply to it, but I'm gonna let it apply to it. Go ahead and roll that as crit damage as if you were attacking with a weapon. I know you're All not right, supposed man, to be able to crit on spells, but Hell yeah. Boo raw. I'm with it. I'm with I mean, it. this is the friendship game. Yeah. Oh. Your beam shoots over Tuskerin's shoulder, and the dust kind of moves to the side, and it hits the hits the lich in his upper shoulder. Yep. And part That'll of his part of his face tearing away his flesh. Now you can kind of see his bone hanging there. You do notice a surprising lack of raspberry jelly. Oh. Oh, that's his problem. That's why he's not <laughs> sweet. He ain't got enough jelly. All right, that's my turn. All right. The Lich is going to Dimension Door. Isn't it our turn first? Don't our guys get to go before him? Isn't the last time they go before no, him? No, he's the, he's the last. He goes, and then they go. Oh, I thought we went before him last time. No. No, I thought the well, Beholder went before him. Oh, the Beholder went first. I don't yeah, actually think he went last time. They both had their turn, haven't they? This yeah. This is the first round. This is the first time the Lich has acted. This is his first turn. He didn't okay. go last round? No. This is the first round. Turn. This yeah. is still the first round, guys. Oh. It's still in the first round. <laughs> right? <laughs> the, Lich, the Lich dimensions doors yeah. over to the corner guard there, and... Another creature's turn. All right. Fanny Fleetfoot. All right, I'm gonna come down here so I can see him. I'm gonna say, "Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why you're so upset, but have a snow pop. It's raspberry flavor." And I'm gonna shoot my hand out, and I'm gonna in my head this in at the back in the forest makes little ice cream pops. And I can shoot at people. And when they catch them, and then they have an, an ice lolly. So I'm going to shoot my snow pop at him. Um, I want to say cartoon character style. They catch them on the fly with their mouth. Like, you shoot it at their mouth, and they catch yeah. it, and it's fine. Uh, but this is actually ice knife. <laughs> oh, nice. It hits. It hits. Nice. Okay, so he needs to make a dexterity 13. Dexterity 13. So he takes ice knife. piercing. Oh, he fell. Oh. Uh, five piercing, and then as the as the ice cream pop gets to him and it stabs into him, it then explodes, and he takes uh, four cold damage as well. And it is the five piercing. All right. And it is technically magical piercing damage. All right then. Then he does take it. By the way. 
That's I good. Know I have to point that out. Good to bring up. I know the stat block meta. Elena knows the stat block. So. Good okay. one of us okay. does. I definitely don't. Granny. Oh, no. no all y'all's friends get to go now. Y'all might get him. First of a holder. The beholder shoots a beam and it goes past the hack, past this area where the lich was, and off into the distance. Yeah. He doesn't know I'm yet. sad. Yeah. York. This is. The night hag is going to fall in behind Fanny and that's it for their turn oh, we'll have the king to move again surround this guy which gives y'all cover if he decides to do a ranged attack snuggle bomb all right so here's the plan blonde you just stick with me wait till I give you the sign. When you hear that noise, that's when you want to shoot. So I want to hold my turn, my prestidigitation for the lich until after his next turn. And I want blind to hold his attack until I cast that. Okay. I see what you're doing. It makes sense. Let's see here. Why do you hear the sound and then attack? Legendary action. Legendary action. Great out. Oh, good to hear. <laughs> this is wild that we're doing this at level three. You'll have an army. Have an army with us at least. We do have an army. The beholder on a leash. All right. The the lich go. <laughs> How about the power of death? And as he flexes, this dome of darkness moves out to about 20 feet from him, getting all the keen to the orc and snuggle bum, as well as the beholder in it. I need constitution. Oh, Saves. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, again. Oh, Woo! nice. <laughs> I don't like Elena, I don't like him this. Rolling so well. This is for all the keen to? Oh no! This is for the orc. No, not the orc. I like him. This is for the beholder. Okay. Everyone failed except for Snugglebum. So you're only going you're only going to take half of this. Snugglebum. But everyone else takes full. All the keen to. 11 damage as this power of oh, this numb bad. death just overtakes you. Now the keen two wow. failed, so they take... For the first time in our furry friend's lives. No. Not the keen two. They witness, no. they witness something losing its life. And unfortunately, rather than being... A single thing. So many things. The orcs, the keen to. All of them just fall motionless. Not the orc. Twenty two is not a lot. The orc should have been fine. He took damage earlier though. Hey, dude, I think the beholder has some kind of he so has protection from evil. I think he might have had it. Yeah, oh no, the bo the beholder's the beholder's fine, he's also a tank. <laughs> That's good. But uh I'm reading it. Can't be Trump Prime Possess. So No The Orc oh, okay. tries to shield these King Two behind him, but as this beam hits him, it was great knowing you guys and Oh no His armor shatters and his body just fades away as he falls back. The King Two becomes dust. My head into the hags. I turn my head into the hags. 
Oh no. But it's, it seems like his shielding was not completely in vain as some of the energy is blocked and Snubble Bomb is able to survive the this feeling as it hits you, like an almost physical feeling of despair. And that would activate my action. I held till he did something. Yeah. So, then I so you can do that. My press of you. And now the Beholder takes his attack. Checking Come for on. no checking for no no beam. Come on. Three. Three is not too shitty. Something though, right? Yeah. It's still pretty bad. Jeez. Yeah. I mean, um, it is the in, it is the innervation ray. Target creature must exceed DC oh. 14 constitution save or take an average of 36 damage. There you go. Let's get a dexterity save, please. Fail. Fail. Oh no, fail. It's, consti fail. it's constitution fail. save. Fail. 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 Yes. Fail. 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 He takes a full 8d8 damage. 29! Yes. Oh dear lord! Yep, yep. No. I, I, I'm really feeling that beholder. Yeah, the the yeah, liches so. the liches robes are torn, his heart, most of his skin's missing. The bones that are below it are cracked. His eyes are glowing. One of them's actually fallen out of his head, and he strides forward past past the corpses of the keen two and the orc. And he still gets an action this round because that thing he did was a legendary Just action. Legendary yep. action. Uh, no one. Somebody else's turn. No one turns my allies against me. And he is. Uh, is he gonna attack me? He is going to attack Snugglebum. Oh. Yeah. Dude, catch protection on myself. With ah. a ray of frost. I don't know if it was clutch because he was about to insult. How's him. this for a snowball fight? And he holds his hand oh. out, and this blizzard erupts. Thirty-one to hit. Oh. This blizzard erupts from his palm. 14 yeah, down, cold man. damage. I'm down. Snuggle Bomb becomes unconscious. Me. <laughs> Long. Me, we. I'm out. Alright. And that would make it Fanny's turn. I roll up my sleeves. Granny's wading into it. Just give her time. Okay, Granny. Um, I've got to look up my new friend. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to get anybody hurt. We just want to be friends, and I don't know why she does that. And then I'm going to, like, shoot another snow pop at... Just be... Actually, no, I'm not. Because he's killed Snow pop's everybody. a bad idea. He's killed everything. It's fine. So I'm just gonna put another snowball swarm right here, right on, right on the back of him, and we're on the Kenku's dead body. All right. <laughs> uh, so dexterity save. Dexterity save. Fail. 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 Where's the lich? Pass. No. Yes. So ten uh, cold damage. Fail. Ten cold damage. Right. And then I'm just gonna curl up and try and use my uh, boop, naturally stealthy ability and hide <laughs> my, my hag friend's skirt and kind of just like hide behind her skirt. Like, there you go. I'm scared. Please help me. That's fair. <laughs> That's fair. Granny. I'm just going to move over here to where my lovely friend here, the pig, is. And I'm going to um, lay my hand down and be like, shh, it's all right, it's all right. You'll feel much better. I have more truffle cupcakes for you. And I'm going to lay on hands, and he gets 5 HP. 5 HP. 
And then right. bonus action, can I shove a potion down his throat? Um, a yeah. Action, I thought. Uh, we'll okay. let it. You know what? I'll let it go as a bonus. It's it's a one shot. It's a rule we keeping galacting out. So because it's fun, we'll let it go. Thank you. Thank you. You oh. get nine on top of that. Thank you, Granny. Nine. Oh, sweet. So, yeah, you get. Five, five and More nine. than I anticipated because I forgot about the potions. Woohoo! Sweet. And Thank then you, Granny. Granny's just gonna wait there to get fucked up. <laughs> Great. And. Ah. Uh... Before you go, Snuggle Bomb. <coughs> Legendary. Oh, Lord. That's going to hit all of us. Everybody, oh, yeah. no, everybody, everybody but uh, Fanny. It's five feet out as he once again disrupts life. Damn. Another beam of dark energy radiates out from him. Or another dome of dark energy. Oh, fuck. Hell, DC 18? Yeah, <laughs> he's rough. You're only meant to be way higher level to fight one of these guys. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, DM. <laughs> You're acting like we chose this. Like we chose the enemy. No, y'all have a huge army. Innocent little creatures, man. It's all up to the beholder. All right, so bad. Grandma Quill's taken half. So no go bum, unfortunately. You're taking full. Yeah, right back down. Nine damage to Grandma Quill. Crap. You had no. You had you had more than nine. You had you had fourteen. You had 18. fourteen. Yeah, but he so. took he took full damage. Oh, that's right. Damn it! Come on, that was the full reason I put you up. There. I know it was worthless. <laughs> now. Damn legendary actions. All right. Liches go. Oh, he still Need gets. He still gets his action. And he don't like this beholder. But it was my turn, right? He did a legendary action, so I'm next, right? <laughs> yeah, and you made you made your death save. Yeah, there you go. I, I thought I mixed, mixed it up. So I made one save. Success. Let's get this. Let's get rid of the one thing that can really fucking end this. He walks up to the beholder, go away, rubs his fingers across it, and it dies. The very power of his word, ripping the beholder from life. Now, having protection from him didn't, didn't do anything. Not on power word kill. No save, so it doesn't matter. It yep. just is all It's pretty bad. Dead. Yeah, it's pretty bad. But I, luckily, I, I think he doesn't get a lot of... Fan no, I don't remember. Fanny. Depends on what the D. I don't remember either. I, I have never looked up a lich, so I don't know. You could have homebrewed him, you know. I could. I could have. <laughs> you never know. I doubt he. I mean, knowing Chris, probably needs straight from the book. Not that I'd go by that shit, anyways. <laughs> okay. Um. I'm gonna use. Two sorcery points and, can, and give myself a first level spell slot so I can cast no pop. No pop at him, but it's gonna miss. It does, in fact, miss. And then I'm gonna step back and hide again. <laughs> step forward, step back. Jeez. Granny. I feel like this turn order is all fucked. Um, it does seem like it is, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I feel like my turn keeps being in weird places. Yeah, cause, oh, actually, after the Lich, one of y'all's friends went to go, so no, the Beholder didn't get an action. The Dusk Hag does. Yes. Let me see if she has some kind of helpy help. 
literally anything at this point. This thing is... <laughs> Can you tell me if he's bloodied at the very least? I'll tell you what, give me a insight. If he was at... <laughs> If he was at, say, 136% when starting this battle. Oh, God, why would you tell me that? He's at 30 now. Nice. Uh, don't stop believing. The, 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 the night hag, the night hag moves forward, breaks her hands out, and produces two claws. Or two clawed hands. One of them hits. Feels five slashing. Oh, that's a hack. All right. Um, and the goblins are still too afraid to act. So we're going to Granny. Granny has one move left. She is going to reach. Uh, uh, we're going to go around here, and then we're going to go here. And she is going to grapple this guy. Can we say her bladed hide thing works in reverse? I mean, it makes sense, yeah. So if you're grappling, you get the bladed hide effect as well. So go ahead and make an athletics versus his dexterity. God damn it, now you roll a crit? An, un, an unbelievable, in a show of unbelievable dexterity as you go to grapple the lich. You go to grapple him at his waist, and what he does is as your hands pass his sides, he puts his forward hands on his knees and lifts his midsection up above his waist, breaking his own spine. <laughs> so your hands just go through air, and then he sets himself back down, and he turns around and he looks at you. You're next. Does he turn his head all the way around? Okay, that's cool. I'll be like... Can, can you do anything else this round? <laughs> I'm gonna drink down my last potion. Smart. Y'all are tantalizingly close. Five HP. Let me get a death save from you. Snuggle. Another <laughs> another success. And in true fashion before he acts. He's gonna use that legendary action again. I hate you. I hate <laughs> you so much. Oh no. So I'll need that from everybody, including the Night Hag. Oh no. Well, I'm actually here. You're actually in it this time. Goblins, you better get your shit together. I have a plus five to Constitution. 18's hard to hit. I have a plus five, though. It would literally anything or higher, and I would have been fine. Everyone else is taking. You better be invisible and in beast mode. We've got to get this shit on hand. No, there's a 25% chance of making that. Imps, now we're another. You're going to die either way. So, <laughs> jeez. Everyone except we're Grandma down. taking full. Oh, I'm down. Oh, that downs. The only people still standing are the Night Hag and Granny, I think. I think unless, he's making unless those before 12 I go, health downs I, you too. Before I go down, I'm like, Meow. I didn't even get to take a fruit potion. <laughs> that is literally the, my health point total, so even if I had taken a health potion and was at full, I still would have been down. Right. All right. Mine's less than that. Only hopes to make the save. Now it's the Lich's turn. He is... Wait a second. Is that considered a spell? <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's just an, it's an ability. Yeah, it's just an ability. I don't... Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't classify it as a spell in the descriptions. <sighs> Fine. It is necrotic Fine. damage if that changes anything. Does it make Granny's it gonna look at the... That's the that's the feature I have. Oh. Granny's gonna look at the lich and she's like in combat mode. She'd be like, 
no matter if you choose to kill me, friendship always wins in the end, eventually. <laughs> Make a persuasion. Add, add advantage. There you go. There you go. Fine. There you go. I'll save you for last. Oh, Ray, do of, that, young sir. Ray of Frost at the Hag. Eight nine. It tells me that hit. All right. That was the Witch's legendary action and his go. We are to Fanny, saving throw. Granny. Granny's going to reach down. She's going to touch her good friend, the pig, have two hit points, and she's going to rummage in his pockets. Can I rummage in his pockets for his health potions? <laughs> <laughs> um, at provoking attack opportunity, yes. Yeah, she'll take it. You're gonna have like old food bits all over your hands. No, no, just one, one to five. He's gonna take this opportunity. Lower than that, he's focused on the hag, or higher than that, he's focused on the hag. Fuck. And as you would expect, well, he might not be able to because he doesn't have a. Oh, he does. He has one melee. He has one melee attack. Yeah. Constitution save. Yeah. Come on, baby. Come on. Keep it. Keep. Keep your I appreciate oh, the try. Biscuit. And Granny is paralyzed. No, I think we're we're boned at this point. Yeah. This well, is when the power fun. of friendship dies. <laughs> I age forever now. Yeah. No. I. Oh, I, I you're think... so dang close, though. Um, well, those goddamn little goblins and those goddamn pixies didn't get in the mix like I told them to. This <laughs> snuggle bomb. All right, let me see what we got here. I might actually stabilize. If you do a 20, I think you pop up, but... A 20 hmm. gets you one health point, yeah. So I'm stabilized. That's three. Three? So so you're just stabilized. You're not. You're not up. I think I'm stable but still unconscious, right? Mm -hmm. Stable but still unconscious. Paralyzing touch at the night hag. You seriously want those pixies in the mix? I know that they can do some damage in their beast form. Tell you what, they'll do there that. There goes the hag. They start turning into beasts. And he sees this. He's gonna move. And he's gotta wait till someone else's turn to end before he can do his thing. Fanny. Granny. You know what? I'm going to make my last one to GM only. We'll see. I'm going to start doing the death saves to GM only. I'm going to make it interesting. I'm going to make it interesting. Snuggle bum. Snuggle bum's stabilized, but he I'm can't just, do anything. Like, unconscious. Right, but if he quits, when, is, when he become conscious? If what happens? If you oh, create, you become yeah. conscious. It's still, it's still, okay. yeah, it's still worth but it. But he's, I mean, yeah, I guess, yeah. Oh. I don't know if that's a rule or not. I think Chris just too safe to. No, a crit, a, it's a rule. A crit is an automatic, if you natural 20 on a death save, you automatically come up with one hit point and you, yeah. and you, and you can take your turn. Right on. I know because it's happened to me once. I saw it happen in a show one time. Yeah. Snuggle bum. 
You come to yeah. with eight hit points. Oh. Granny, oh. you come to with four hit points. Fanny, you come to with eight hit points. Yay. As you see these goblins standing over y'all with now empty fruit juice potions, punch potions, punch bottles. Uh, oh, thank, thank you. you. The Lich. Been more helpful before my turn. Is Thanks. Gonna do his thing. This time I believe he's getting all the force friends involved. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna be real bad. I'm oh, that's everybody. Feet, son of a bitch. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, yeah, I think y'all are yeah, I think y'all are fine. I don't think y'all are in range. Nope, I'm a no, I'm exactly oh, no. everyone else is dead. I'm exactly 20 feet. Fanny and the Goblin. Fanny and the Goblin. I love that. <laughs> it's a great show. All right, 17. So, full damage. I'm just going to say I'm back down. Because... Yeah, I mean, is there's the lowest yeah. possible it can deal is six. All right. Close, though. If I would have had... One more hit point, I could have still been down at zero if I did that. And he is going to Ray of Frost the Imp. And miss. One. And miss. The Imps. It's an Imp. The Imps now transform into their beast modes. And get oh, and get to act this turn. Jeez. Are the Imps going to clutch this? Those Imps were terror truly not okay so yeah maybe nope both attacks miss from the imps it's fine everything's fine it's fine everything's fine it's all fine don't worry about it it's fine, it is, fine. it's not fine it's okay it's not fanny fine. i just think it's funny how <laughs> hang on let me I'm keeping yeah, I'm rolling death saves in secret, so I wanna keep tension elevated. They they reset when you're up and go down, right? Yeah, they reset. Yes. Okay. The only reason Quartz was alive so long. Granny. <sighs> Granny's gonna scoot on along and This map, I just realized no. how atrocious it looks. If anyone didn't know what led to this, <laughs> and even if they do, this is crazy. It's like... Granny's gonna scoot here on the outer rim, and she's gonna scuffle in Franny's bag for one of her potions and gonna drink it, give it to her. All right? Did you have any more potions, Franny? I believe I'm Franny. I, have, I, I not used any of them. So All I right. Can... No, go ahead and Let's wait, did the goblin did the goblin use one of my potions to do what it did? No, they had their own potions. Okay. And I have not used any of my potions. So I have two. All right. So no, I have one. And can she with the rest of her movement pull her further away? Um, yeah, sure. You can move half your movement while carrying Fanny. And that'd be the that'd be the last of your your action. Snuggle bomb. All right. Hit this guy with another kindness beam. See if I can do some damage here. Need to do a deck attack. Do you him. not have Eldritch Blast on your thing? That is Could Eldritch be. Blast. Is he calls it a friendship beam? <laughs> yeah, it's not. No, no. I'm just wondering why why you're not just hitting it like the attack module. I don't know. Oh. I don't know. It's not. It's not doing right. Might still be having some issues. Unfortunately, a miss. Yeah, I miss, and I don't. I don't really have anything else I can do. I think I will move over here to try to join my friends. And be like, How's it going? Are we all right? It's rough. We're very not all right. This is bad. Stick in there. Not worried about us. So one of the imps passes. Now, furry friends. This will be for all the furry friends. 
Come on, come on. Shoot. Not good. He's a lot of a lot of crits in that one. Ah. That's bad. Poor little thing. Oh no. Yeah, I think that's all of our furry friends. If the Kanku didn't live, goodbye. Oh, the furry friends. Is my hag friend still awake? Fall unconscious. Or yes, the paralyzed. Just paralyzed, yes. Not gonna lie, your hag friend was not super effective in combat so far. Uh, night hags actually aren't that great in combat, and like, they're more, uh, they, they fuck with you when you're asleep. Yeah. They, they aren't really good in combat situations. Ah. Uh. Their power is in making sure that you, when, by the time you get to them, you're so weakened that you are useless. And they're more hit and Got run it. kind of thing. They prey on they prey on you right, when you're all ready. Yeah. Yeah. They, it's more of a manipulation, and um, like they're they're specifically on for invading your dreams and trying to turn your thoughts dark. Because if they can make you commit an evil action, uh, they get your soul forever. Cool. I love night hags. By that they're I my mean favorite. horrified. They're my favorite. I love night hags. More on hags. You're like definitely gonna get adopted by this lady if we survive. I want to. I love her. I'm trying to make her love me. That's like the whole point. I, yes. I, I want her. I'm I love seeing her. that. I want to be her familiar. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's fine. Fanny. <clears throat> y'all. Like y'all are the only ones standing now with the goblins. Everything else is motionless on top of this castle, other than the lich. And he Why turns. Why not be so rude? <laughs> but I sing that. Un but I sing it under my breath, uh, quietly, so that he can't hear that I'm awake because I. Since he's, he's looking at the forest friends, right? right? He meant looking well, he's, at them, right? he's turning around from them. He would know after the Mist Eldritch Blast that there is activity on that side of the tower. Okay, yeah. I'm going to throw my last snow pop at him. 19 to hit. 19 to hit. Roll damage. 9 piercing, 4 cold. 4 cold. And that's right, it's, ma it it's magic, isn't it? Nine piercing is magic, and he needs to do a DC 13 deck save. Roll freaking low for that four cold. Oddly dexterous, these undead lich. Damn it! Okay, so it doesn't take the cold, but it does still take the nine piercing. Okay. Because it's magical, and then as a bonus action, I'm going to take my last potion. Whoop, whoop! I don't know if it's going to do me any good, but hey. Granny. Granny is going to search in her bag of tricks for the biggest cake that she has. <laughs> oh, okay. um, ignore that. Ignore that. Ignore all right. That all right. <laughs> Wouldn't it be amazing if that worked on the lid? <laughs> she's going to move right slightly closer, and she's going to grab a big old cake and chuck it at his face in the hopes that to give him disadvantage to attack because he has to get cake off of him first. Make a dexterity, you know, a, a range attack. Can I say with proficiency at this point? Because I have been throwing cakes <laughs> all day. Um, sure. Awesome. You have made it a point that you are definitely good at that. That's actually an 18. Actually an 18. Because it's... Your cake hits him dead in the face. Yes! And he is going to actually... He immediately like grabs it and starts claw, trying to claw it off of his face. Good luck with that. That is a deep chocolate mousse cake. Snuggle bomb. I'm done can I take the dodge action as like my no that's yeah. a full action. Oh, isn't okay. It? I'll take that second. I'll do a uh I'm gonna do another one of my kindness beams. And this time wait, hold on. I put it in there. That's a hit. Alright. It'll be a five. Oh my god, guys. Alright. It is the Lich's go. He spins his round, getting cake yes. off of his face. Yes. 
Do you nice. not see what has happened here? Clearly I am superior. Clearly I am the one that needs to succeed in their goals. Not friendship. Oh, not even hate. Me. Just me. Grudix. Whatever superior has more friends. Fanny, as he begins striding to y'all, y'all can see the look in his eyes. He knows if he gets to y'all, it's over. This is do or die. Two to hit. That's a hit. Nice. And it will do three whole cold damage. <laughs> do this. Whole cold. Ah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is the problem. We are Literally now down all I to have. the wire. Gritty. Nothing left. Oh. Granny's got what she's got. Um, you know, like one hit point. Look at Chris. <laughs> I'm gonna watch. I'm gonna watch up. this later just to read this. Nothing left. <laughs> uh, I don't think this is magical, so I don't think it's gonna do very good. But she's gonna like slap him with a rolling pin one yes. last time. Come on, Granny. With a rolling pin? It is it a I magical? I mean, it carries pin? the spirit of her love, but it's probably not magical. Look at him calculating in his head. Yeah. Would that be Look at him doing magical? That. Tell me. <gasps> yes. Read his obituary to me, Granny. Nice. She, she walks up like a strident, angry grandmother. And you, like, you know when you've done something wrong and you know you're about to get a tell into. She walks up. Young man, you will learn how to play with others. And then she smacks him in the shins, which you all know is the most cripplingly painful area of the Ow. entire body. <laughs> and he just falls down and shatters. And then she goes, Y'all, y'all, y'all stay uh, there in time out. Y'all well see here. it as she, as she gives this pin into the air. Almost, you know this pin is not magical. It's just a rolling pin. But as she rages and mentions that it's filled with the power of friendship, you see that everyone on the field, their energies, despite being unconscious, roll into this pin and it takes on this vibrant, iridescent glow. And as she brings it down, it demolishes the lich's legs. And as he falls, he begins decaying. <laughs> the tower begins to crumble, but y'all are safely lowered down. Y'all's friends begin to awake as the weird grasp of this dark energy leaves y'all celestial land and your rules start to take charge again. Everyone refills with their raspberry jam. The keen two friends raise up, now clearly, salt cliff dwellers yet again. Your gazer, the beholder, the once dead, scary looking toothy ball of eyes, fully cured, not even undead anymore. This green ball of just smiles and bright looks. The night, hey. the dusk hag y'all made friends with bends down and becomes another porcupine, a slightly brighter version than y'all's friend Granny, but looking almost like a twin sister. The goblins themselves even become cleaner, more respectable members of themselves. And that dark patch that was in the iridescent wood slowly grows back and refills itself. Yay! Friendship! Granny friendship. looks at a rolling pin and kind of swings it one or twice <laughs> and it like, you know when you swing a thing in anime and it does like the path of movement, it does like a rainbow now and she's like, this is gonna always this? Yes. This is, this is what I get in the way of my baking. Congratulations, friendship has slayed the witch. The lich. Yay. The lich. The lich. I would like, yeah, I run up into the, to our new porcupine friend's arms and I, I snuggle. Good work, everyone. The mud to we all it. deserve some cake. And I pull out like a seven layer birthday cake that you see on cartoons. It's like